Alright guys, welcome back to Divinity Original Sin. I'm apparently coming up here. Uh, actually, Subiel should take it. Scoopy. Divinity Original Source Hunter. Delicious. We are hunting source. Alright, so we're gonna go head over this way. Uh, oh dude, there's corpses here. Sweet. No, 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 I don't, I wanna, I don't wanna know if they're alive. Fuck. One's alive here. The spirit flails, casting about wildly, as if surrounded by horrific enemies. An animalistic whine emanates from him. He does not seem to be able to see or hear you. He howls with rage and scrabbles backwards, still unable to see you, but certainly suffering under the force of your source vampirism. With a last gasp, he disappears, leaving only an atmosphere of terror. <laughs> You're a bad man. I have I have villain tag, man. Can't wait to use that. You can have one of them. <laughs> oh no! Synchronized. No. What happens if we do it on like the same one? I don't want to think about it. Oh okay. Ah, uh, there's another way up through here. Interesting. Ah, uh, there's a yarrow flower. Cause you intel hente. I don't give a fuck though. I'm bad feels. Alright. Garo go. Alright, Red Prince is coming through. He's a bad to the bone. B -b bad to the bone. Actually, let's go to this side first. This? I don't know. Probably like the other side of the shrine? Yeah. Did we not explore there? Guess we didn't. Actually, there's someone here. What's the watcher like doing? like those black ring made a lethal enemy. Okay. You approach an undead, standing proud at the lip of a broken bridge. Understandably fearless of the fatal drop, she gazes into the lava sputtering below. Turning to you, she motions to the black ring corpses at her feet. Good riddance to bad rubbish, eh? Only thing I like less than black ring are trolls. Godwoken, are you? Uh, you are Zoral Stissa's chosen. I thought so. I see it on you like an aura. I see such things, for I am the Watcher. And I seek such things, for I am a Seeker. Uh, she looks a little deceased to be a Seeker. I wasn't always as you see me now, but I swore an oath. This oath I defended to my grave. And I will continue to defend it until such time as the gods themselves deem it fit to end my vigil. I am one of the original Seekers. We swore to be Knights of the Council, Guardians of Godwoken, and Defenders of Divinity. Together, we failed. But still, I try. Alone. Take your bait. Uh, take your bait, unless what? The Knight of Duna has been cursed. Void runs through his veins where Source once flowed. I am sworn to protect the Council and all within it. But that same oath renders me unable to lift a blade against him. Release the knight's good spirit from his corrupted shell, Godwoken. Do this, and I will gift you with the last standard of the original Seekers. If you seek ascension, it could help you greatly in the trials along the way. You can count on us. My thanks, and the thanks of Duna's knights too. In life, I knew him well. He would hate to be like this. Believe me, you would be releasing him from torment. Please do. Alright, well, there's a, a Knight of Duna. Uh, uh, oh, it's an entrance to a Dwarven Temple. Also, there's we're, a we're lot... We're have to go in there, but let's go in there. There's a lot of shit there, yeah. Fucking, let's do it. And teleporting everywhere. Use your legs like a real man. There's a lot of fire around here. Cursed fire cloud. Oh, whatever. Well, we're going to the Dwarven Temple. See you later. Let's, let's go see. Let's go talk to the Dwarven God. Uh. Gonna molest him too? <laughs> you know it. How's this? A voice that is not your own rises within your skull. You are no child of Duna. Leave now, or face his wrath. Hey, you wanna talk to 
the giant dwarven face. With the uh, dwarf? Do I? Yeah. Oh yeah, I've already heard that. Enter freely, child of Duna, but bring none of foreign blood. They are not welcome. Yeah, go fuck yourself. I'll do whatever I want. The deal shares lucky charm with Prince. Oh man, I found something something for dwarf. <laughs> oh man. Why is that his name now? <laughs> it just is. Bring not foreign blood. I'm gonna go talk to the Granite Protector. Level 16, I'll go fucking kick your ass if you decide to come alive on me. Yeah, that's right, bitch. Oh, motherfucker. Uh, yeah, you. Coming to life? Yes, it did. It touched me. Yeah, it barely. It tickles. Oh, dude, water bomb. Nice. This won't be of any use. Alright. Sibyl's taking damage. Okay, Sibyl, fuck, it, fuck off, Sibyl. Sibyl, I swear to Christ. Sibyl's right. dying, eh? She doesn't have HP for this fucking little adventure. I'm just stealing shit. Alright. Oh, what the- Oh, it's racist. It doesn't fucking want to hit you, huh? Yeah, it is. I'm gonna take its source. I'm having a fucking slapping match with it. Who's gonna win? I have death with this bitch. <laughs> you met the statue. Do you see how fast it was moving? Alright, sweet. It has nothing. You pissed me hey, off. Black I'm ring, sorry. bro. I'm just gonna walk past you. A glass of wine, nice, nice. Watermelon, nice. All right. I have a lot of crap in my inventory. I, I why do I have so many fish? I have 34 oranges. When did this happen? Friend, the bicorn hat. What? What the fuck are you talking about? Beast hat friend, which is a company B. I have my own hat. Give me. You have you have a hat. What the fuck did you just say? Good to have you home, friend. Don't go running off on me again. Beast storyline, dude. What? Why does he have a fucking magical talking hat? What is the fuck is this? Harry Potter? All fucking your Gryffindor piece of shit. Yeah, right, so it. Throw it on the ground, I want to see it. Well, it doesn't do anything, it's just, well, sure, I'll throw it on the ground so you can look at it. Wait, it's a talking hat, how does it not do anything? Plus two wits, plus two, six initiative. Immunity to terrify. Oh, nice. It's not a good hat, but I'll put it up for the memes. Oh, fuck. I just spent my time, like, destroying all these things, and, and now there's like ten of them there. We lost. Just don't worry about it. I got a note. A note found with the folds of Beast's spike-on hat. Alright. Right. To the beast of the sea, I thought you might want this back. Fight fiercely, Duna. Oh, how nicely. How nice. Oh, magic armor <laughs> potion. Neat. You get... could just let me do the looting. What is this fucking... Nah. What is this show of dominance? Nah, it's fine. Fucking look, I'm gonna take this and loot. You're gonna watch. I, oh shit. It's Taho here. Or Taho? Sibyl. Yeah. yeah has the this. famous game, Taho. Yeah. Ah, suckers. Oh, there's a cursed knight of Duna. Oh, dude, we have to be here. We gotta fuck that thing up. Yeah. I just figured you'd have to fucking. You know, you want, you want beast to talk to it first, stupid. or or do you want me to villain it? You know what? You made it here. You can do the villain it. Do no, it. No, 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 no. It's beast story. It's beast story. He can All go talk. All right. He can go talk to it. Oh shit! 
With great armored fist, the Knight of Duna pounds his own helmet rhythmically. The helmet has been buckled inwards in, in places. Uh, whatever the fuck of blood trickle from beneath the visor. <laughs> Come, hear my joke. What is it that I got? Tell the knight to stop beating himself like that. This is a sacred place for your people. The knight rams his fists into his helmet. The metal groans inwards. Surely none could survive such pressure. And yet... There is nothing sacred here. There never was. He showed me. It's all a joke. There's nothing to guard. Only lies. You'll see for yourself once you're dead. Implore to calm down and you do what you can to help him. Rip. Your persuasion oh. zero needed three. It tells you now. Oh, yeah, it does. Enough words. Show me your steel. Alright, so we, we know what's I mean, happening here. I mean, we're going to kill it anyways, let's be honest. Uh, why do I get the feeling that all these dwarven things are going to come alive? Nah. Ready to stop? Yeah, sure. I don't, I don't, I don't give a fuck. Is your guardian angel? A motherfucker. I need left their, <laughs> need left their abilities. Uh, let's see, how many, how many, how fucked are we? Actually, not overly fucked. The only thing is that they do have Guardian Angels, so maybe I should delay my turn and let you teleport him away from one of those things. I can't teleport them because they are fortified. Oh, well, mother, he's fortified. Mother but I might be able to teleport the statue away. Yeah, yeah, you can do that. Let me try that. I will delay my turn. I'll delay his turn as well. It's from delay. Yeah, I mean... I mean, nobody, like... Oh, only that granite protector gets a turn. The fuck? Get another. Are you gonna... I guess actually I could have never swapped him with one of us, but eh, I can do it next time. I mean, he's fortified, you can't swap him. Or or you mean the statue? No, I meant the statue. I mean, yeah, you could have never swapped the deal, and then... Wow, you're fucking awful. Yeah, I am. You're so bad? Wait one second, shame banks. Yeah, good old champing. The classics. Eh, let's do this. Okay. Oh, what, what do I do? Just fucking jump in there? Like, what the fuck? Dude, you have like you... so. <laughs> it gives you 10 wits and 5 finesse. You, c you can't even fucking overpower him at all. No, I can. I mean, can you? Dude. Should I delay my turn then? Yeah, delay. He 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 has more armor than you. That doesn't matter. Okay. He went delay? first anyway. Wait. What? Oh yeah, it was first. Alright, I'll just kill. Oh well. Him. I don't know. What, what do I do? <laughs> I guess go hit him. <laughs> okay, fine. Uh, I don't know, fucking... Maybe I'll become a spooky spider. Nah, I'll just fucking... I was all in him. Alright, go do, go do dwarf stuff. Why am I slowed? I guess because I'm next to this guy. Well, I'm gonna. Try out of pharma, no. I'm gonna get tactical will. advance when it's my turn, and I'm gonna air spray his ass, so. Okay, I'm gonna spread my wings and just fly down there, get out the slow. And this should be fine. Because it'll do damage to him. Alright. I can't oh, you were in see oil. that motherfucker? You you were in oil. That's why you were slowed. Ah, neat. Oh, I guess you did. You did. We did this all the round. <laughs> okay. Should I even bother? Uh, I mean, I can't actually hit him. I mean, should I even bother? Like fucking arrow spraying him? Like. I mean. But he gets a turn. 
No, he won't. He's gonna die. Look at this shit. Oh, wow. It's fucking whatever. Yeah, I'll even adrenaline for this. So there's absolutely no way we can fuck this up. Actually, I probably need, need to have adrenaline. Easiest game of my life. Game's easy. Oh, shit. Sibyl is determined. Alright, I'm gonna go talk to this, this thing. Alright. Oh, man. A two-handed axe? That's a piece of shit. And I took it. The Knight of Duno's Helmet. Uh, it gives you... Okay, dude, this is like an amazing helmet, so... If Beezus want it, I will take it. Oh, no, you definitely need this uh, skill book. Uh, this is a good helmet. It is an excellent helmet. Red Prince just has some fucking trash. Oh, dude, look at that helmet! You have it on you? Oh, yeah, you do have it on you. And he has the same helmet, how is that possible? Alright. The spirit of a dwarven knight I think acknowledges it nice. you with a solemn nod. Beware of this island, Godwogan. I fear there is nothing sacred here. Only madness and death. The Sallow Man has seen to that. I have failed the gods. The only thing left for me now is nothingness. Please, Godwogan, consume my spirit. End my shame. Uh, ask what happened to him. The Black Ring came and sacked the temple. The one that leads them, the Sallow Man. He cursed me. A curse of madness and terrible visions. Uh, what kind of visions? The spirit averts his gaze with a shiver. I will not say it. It would be blasphemy to even utter the words. The Sallow Man is a trickster, a deviant. They must have been lies that he concocted. They must be! Yeah, I'll turn to other matters. Uh... Inform that the Knight Spirit that the Sallow Man is dead. He can, he can consider himself avenged. Good. I thank you. Hopefully that creature's lies will rot alongside him. Uh, say so you need to access the Council of Seven as soon as possible. There's little I can do to help you. It's the altars that have that power. Bow to the altar of Duna, and to those of the others also. If you are worthy, they will show you the way. I... I was not worthy. I failed the gods twice over now. All I deserve is nothingness. Fran and say he was a godwoken, one of the chosen few. He shouldn't doubt his self-worth worth in this way. I... I was not worthy. I betrayed my own nature. I made a pact with a demon, so I would triumph over all others in the council. But the gods saw through my rules, and I was rejected. I begged them to let me serve here on the island to pay penance. They should have cast me into the sea instead. The sallow man proved I am still weak at heart. Say you don't want to consume his corpse. Please! I failed my duty and let myself be corrupted. Now I'm just a potential weapon to be used against you. Grant me oblivion, I beg you. Ah, uh, no. A pained look flashes across the spirit's face. As you will it, Godwoken. All right, see ya. Now this is my throne. Well, I'm gonna talk to my god. Yeah, fuck you. Carved into the face of the altar is dedica uh, dedica uh, dedication. In honor of Duna, patron of the dwarves, long may their mountain halls stand as a testament to him. There is no sign of life from the altar. You run your hand across the lunar rune carved into its surface and walk away. Nice. That's it. Maybe he didn't want to talk to you. Maybe you suck. Carved onto the face of the altar is a dedication in honor of Duna. There yeah. is no sign. Uh, that's it. Okay. Well, we already know what, what, what the solution here is. Once you get Dwarf to talk to him and consume his source, he, he wanted you to eat his shit. <laughs> oh, you, I, I've already done all the dialogue here. Please! Don't consume his source when I consume his source. Offers a stoic nod, accepting his fate. Nice. Thank you. Look to the altars for guidance. Wow, nice job, asshole. I would never do a thing like that. I would never do that. Delicious! I, I am a nice person with the villain tag. I'm a villain when I want to be. You know what? It was a mercy killing. He was asking for it. Alright. Oh, that's rude. So rude. Alright, I'm just gonna walk through here. I don't even care. 
Oh. You, you, you give a fuck about your poison? I was wondering what the fuck this was about, but it's a, sh it's a shortcut. Oh uh, yeah, you can you can go there. That's fine. I'll just. Uh... Like you, you could skip the entire bullshit if you wanted to. Uh, why would I want to do that? That's half the fun. All right, I'm gonna tell uh, whatever the fuck that the bullshit is dead. Also, there's like two bases. There's a couple bases here. What the fuck? You didn't loot these? What's wrong with you? Guess I missed them. Wow. See, I'm supposed to handle the rail guns, and you're supposed to handle. Hey, Mr. Vaz. I mean, that's your job, though. All right. Oh god, there's so many actually tucked away in this corner. I mean, you can't reach. Fuck you. You can reach. You just have to believe. So, do we want to try and go through the fire, uh, like all the way over there? That's a question. Do we? All right. I guess that answers that. Let me go talk to the watcher. Ah, oh, God woken. You have succeeded where I could not. Please accept this with my thanks, and the thanks of all those I served alongside. The blessings of the original Seekers upon you. She hands you a small yet heavy trinket, crafted of tarnished metal. Though cold, it feels comforting to the touch, like a worry stone or a familiar childhood toy. Ah, sweet. You want, you want a staff, or a wand, or a uh, bronze armor, which actually isn't that bad? Or uh, if I can leather breeches. Armor might be good. I mean, what's what's your physical armor on your current armor? 378. 378. This is less than that. Oh, well, fuck. But you will inflict burning on contact. <laughs> Wait, does that have a slot on it? Oh, yes, it does. Yeah, let me take the slot out of this armor, because I got a, a big one in mine. 292 without this the slot. Oh, okay, then this is slightly more. What are the stats on it, though? 10% uh, fire resistance, 1 to Huntsman, and inflict burning on contact. Eh. Nah. Okay, I will. Like, let's like there's nothing else better. It, I mean, it's there's some pa the fucking pants for Sabiel, so... You know how much Sabiel loves pants. A lot. Alright, I'm gonna toss you a F and a belt. You let me know if it's something that you like. Uh, but I don't want it, so go fuck yourself. So right. basically, you don't want it and you want me to sell it. Alright, uh, well, uh, yeah, basically. So Red Prince is going on a Super Mario adventure, so. Alright, so, I may never return. I'm, I'm on the hunt for Death Fog and Death Fog accessories. Uh, let's go down here. Hey, look, a piece of candy. I love hammered scale. It's a piece of shit. Fuck, can I really not make it back up there? We lost. Well, whatever, I'll just teleport to Sabeel. Dude, this area's fucked up. Which area? Where are you? Just know the entire area that you're in, I'm just looking at it. Yeah, I know. That's how I like it. What the fuck is Sabeel doing here? What the fuck? Oh, apparently I didn't need to jump over here. Oh shit, that hurts. Uh, hopefully Sabeel's not following. <laughs> it says 1 to 2 damage, but it was a lot more than that. Oh, sweet. A metal shield. A crappy ass ring. I don't want it. And rain scroll. Give that to Effin. Uh, what else is here? Alright. Oh, there's a skeleton here. Reactive shot? I don't want that. Fuck. 
I was going to add to wears. A stunning necklace. You know, I didn't even look at... Um, yeah, you can... I don't I, I don't want this fucking... Well, it's actually not that bad. Eh, it's, it has no stats on it. I don't want it. Fuck it. Okay. You can also sell this. So I'll give that to Beast. More shit. So we got... To, oh, I have Guardian Angel in a fucking amulet. Sweet. Nice. Awesome. What room do I have? Now you too can use it. Exactly. I'm gonna out whatever miss you. You will not tank me, boy. Fucking think I won't. So what if we both have a guardian angel? We'll do like an infinite loop. No, oh, no. So how do you think we, we get over nothing here? Will happen. How do you how do you think we get over here? Probably getting up here. Oh, you think that's the solution, huh? Be fucking good down there. Alright. Oh, uh, we gotta go actually all the way around, I think. I oh, know, no, I don't actually. Just gotta look for a bit of fire, you know? I know, it's okay. I, li I actually like it. Also, up here looks interesting, kind of. Yeah, I'm looking around. What's this? Oh, I shit! Found something. Oh, fucking digging rock, man, with my claws. Nice. Oh, ancient this artifact. Again. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a lot of those. I got an ancient artifact. <laughs> there goes this again. Uh, eternal plate? Oh, shit. Uh, I'm not gonna take that, but... Actually, maybe it's important for something. Um, I'll give you a new wand. There is the trumpet of death. Oh shit, I'm gonna get the trumpet of death. It's not the trumpet of death, it's just the death trumpet. Hate to let you down. No, no, it, it's literally the trumpet of death. I can consume it. Uh, what will it do? It's it's an herb. Eat uh, it, go, go on. I mean, I, judging by the name, I, I, I think that's a bad idea. Pussy. I, I'm just saying. Fine, you, you fucking go eat it then. You can give it to uh, Beast. Eat it or I'm never talking to you again. Okay. What was it gonna do? Kill me? I mean, it is the, the fucking trumpet of death. You're the I'll only find way out of this. It's the last thing I gave you. Yeah, I have like four of them, so I, I can, I've had <laughs> some of those. You've eaten them before. What does it do? Oh, resistance. Resistance everything. Oh, nice. I was wrong then. It happens on occasion. Oh, dude, there's a fucking skeleton here. Nice. I want a sack? Yeah. Are you just fucking watching me? I'm just gonna fucking have a nap. <laughs> Those are chests right there. I know. Unidentified chest armor. Intelligence 13. Oh, I'll just pass it to FM. I love being over encumbered. Yeah, I know you do. I know how to treat you right. Alright, I don't think there's anything else here. Alright, let's go to the other side then. Hmm. Uh, well, there's a fucking dwarf skeleton. What? Dwarf skeleton? Oh no, he's dead. Rip. Oh no. Rip dwarf. Greater healing potion. Uh, yeah, those are kinda nice. Fucking some bullshit. Fuck wheelbarrows. Did you fucking chain ping? I know, I saw it. I was just looking around. So I think there's something buried there. Cause look at that. I, I don't know, they man. They think they're smart. Well, I can't see it, apparently. <laughs> we can see it, but Red Prince can't. Furbing <laughs> Sabeel over there. Alright, Sabeel. What do Elven I see? Let me your aid. I've spotted something. <laughs> <laughs> Thinking. He needed permission to dig there. It's okay. Oh, shit. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, shit. I'm going in there. 
Gotta go down there. The abandoned service tunnel. Do I want to come in there with you? Of course you do. I actually don't know. The doors loom above you. One step closer to the council. One step closer to divinity. The others must surely be thinking the same. After all, only one of you can ultimately ascend. Time for an honest discussion, perhaps. Oh. We're finally here. On the doorstep of divinity. Merits a word, doesn't it? After all, only one of us can become the new divine. But don't worry, I won't stand in your way. From the moment you came back for me on that ship, I knew you were special. You've proven it time and again. She kisses you on the cheek. You will be the new divine. I will remain myself. All I ever wanted, really. Oh. Sabila's A-OK. -okay. She supported me in my quest to become divine. How about your fucking follower? Well, what's that? Why are you it with feet? I have too much to carry. <laughs> 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 oh shit! All right, go go talk to dwarf. A beast looks at you, or even through you, but beyond you, beyond the academy, to a place far from you, but close to him. The fuck? How I edgy. know I talk a lot, but I don't talk about the Isle of Mists that much. No reason to, most of the time. Can't stop thinking of that time today, though. My crewmates and me, we can handle prison. We can handle death, even. But ain't no one should handle the Isle. You don't see the mist. You, you don't hear it. It's just there. In front of you, on top of you, and in you. Then the ripping starts. Your dreams ripped away. Your thoughts, your self, it's in you, and it is you. Your body is meat, perfectly preserved. The mist keeps it safe. It's your soul that's boiled. I'm not looking to ascend because I want the power. I'm not doing any of this for me. I'm doing it so the rebels never need face the isle. So the mist will never be in them. So they can be truly free, fearless, themselves. As soon as I stop Operation Downfall, I rejoin them. As far as I'm concerned, that's where my divine duties begin and end. <laughs> Dude, he left the party, by the way. He left, let's see, he left the party for you as well. Oh, oh, because you have to convince them. Strength, memory... Oh, uh, shit. What are you gonna tell him? Mm. He may not rejoin you if you <laughs> if you fucking fuck this up. I'll save it for you, actually. Note how irresponsible that is. He shouldn't pursue divinity if he isn't going to take it seriously. Damn. No. I've seen the selfishness in you, and I wonder, do you know what it means to be loyal? Do you know what it is to be depended on? To matter to someone? <laughs> I mean... You're, you're, you're the, already the arena champions, fine. <laughs> what else would you possibly want? But what are you going to do? Uh, so I don't want to do what it takes to ascend, I guess. If that's selfish, then so be it. And there you have it. I gave you every chance to show me who you were. So you did. <laughs> oh, oh. oh, shit. Oh, shit. He, he chose to face me battle for a chance at divinity. Oh, shit. He just took all our loot with us. That motherfucker. Let's go get him. Ah, uh, he's gone. Yeah, uh, so, uh, what do you want to do? Like, you loaded a bit back? <laughs> uh, I mean, how- f I mean, I can do it just before I talk to the door. So what are you- what are you gonna do? Just go- go to the fucking Lady Vengeance, respect it to Persuasion, and then fucking come back? No! <laughs> no, it's not what's gonna do at all! <laughs> oh, you motherfucker. 
Uh, but go ahead, go do that. I I, I know how how much a setting to it's do that fucking, is. You get a free pass, like just yeah, no, like just, yeah, just it's it's because me me and Seville, we fucking you know, we 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 click, you know, you know she she eats she eats fucking arms, and I can relate to that, you know. As as a Yoshi, I can relate to eating uh, fucking God. various body parts. It's so annoying that like I get punished for not having persuasion, though. Uh, it, it, you weren't punished for not having persuasion. You were punished for not apparently having a close relationship with your uh, with your uh, companion. Apparently, That's I thought that I didn't bang him. Yeah, exactly. God knows, I tried. I mean that that was that was my uh, so I didn't even have to do pass a pers persuasion check. She just said, "Yeah, you're, she's fine with it." The doors loop. The others must surely be thinking. I'm gonna go tell her. Merits a but don't worry. She kid you. Okay. I mean, let me see if there's any other oh, dialogue to say with her. Uh. I mean, I, I did help her with her goals too, you know. So like, oh, you know what it is? I know what it is. It's um, it's my uh, reputation with her is extremely high. That's why. Can't. Yeah. Okay. Anyways, I'm gonna go say uh, the master's dead. She's free. Ask how it, it feels to finally have reached, achieved her goal. It feels magnificent, if somewhat unreal. But first things first. You look on as Sabeel bears her arm and drags her needle across the word master like a knife. Drowning the black ink in blood. Um, whisper a few words of healing magic and place uh, a hand over the wound. With a few ripples of source, the wound closes, leaving behind but new scar tissue that effaces all trace of the hated word that was. Thank you. You're such a sweetheart. Aww. She laughs. Her cat eyes dance with mirth. Now it's over. Uh, lean in for a kiss. You kiss very tenderly. Next, she takes your hand in hers, meets your eyes in earnest. I just... I just can't thank you enough. I could never have defeated the Master without you. I owe you... everything. See, perhaps she owes you divinity now. Smile and say she owes you nothing. But I do, and I won't forget. I... am free now. She places a hand over the fresh scar on her arm. I've known the opposite too long to want to spend another day hollow with hate, another night hollow with loneliness. Ah, oh, move a little closer and tell her she never need to be lonely again. I know I needn't be if you show me a little love. You kiss her on the cheek and she laughs, full of life. Um, look her over, she's rooted to the elven trees, what does that mean exactly? It's strange to picture it, isn't it? To be rooted. Essentially, it means that my people's memories will become my memories. All of them. Can you stop making me rock hard? I swear to Christ. It's never gonna happen between me and, me and you. Please. It means that when eventually I die, I'll become the new mother tree, as my roots join with those of all other ancestor trees all over the world. So, I guess that also means that when my time comes, you may have to water me once in a while. Laugh and assure her you'll be, be an excellent gardener. <laughs> excellent. That's settled then. You can recline against me with a good book. Cherished in the shade I'll throw. Who knows? You may even be a god by then. Gods can talk to trees, can't they? We'll chat. Of course, as Mother Tree, I will always be responsible for the entire elven race. Forever. Your heart aches as you see a deep sadness pervade her. I guess I forgot to say that being rooted also means I've given up on the dreams of freedom I so cherished as a child. Uh... Tell her she's just destined for a different kind of freedom. She laughs. <laughs> I have no idea what that means, but it cheers me up nonetheless. Alright. Go. Go, sexy town the dwarf. <laughs> You have too much to carry. Why does that happen? Because um, it gives you all the stuff. Oh, I see. oh, that's why. I know I talk. Can't stop thinking of. Yeah, my shut up, beast. <laughs> shut up. You I fucking shut up. cut. You broke up with me. We we're supposed to be bros. You're an irresponsible prick. <laughs> beast pauses, then nods. I will do this for you, but I also do it for more than you. Uh. That's right, bitch. 
Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Why am I still over incumbent? Yeah, because you gotta give it back to him. My game's broken! What happened? There we go. Alright. 40 journal updates available. Alright, we're, so we're in the, the Council of Seven. No, oh, it gave me a teleport from it, that's why. That's actually the funniest fucking thing I've ever seen. I'm gonna catch up with you gotta respec. No, I'm not gonna. I think I actually can. I mean, I mean, you can actually if you want. I'll do it later. No, no, because I, I I want to end the episode now. Okay. As I said, you should have banged dwarf when you had the chance, and probably shouldn't have called him dwarf so much. This is probably why he hates you. I mean, you need to max out persuasion. You literally need persuasion do. five. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's like the. <laughs> it's actually the funniest shit ever. All right, guys. See you later. Um, fucking bye.